that we only have one color left. Yep. Blonde oak. We had five, but. You had five. That's it. Bob Rainer, I told you this story before, I'll tell it again. Go My ahead. husband, Joe, loves vinyl. Like many people, he's mm -hmm. rediscovered that what's old is new. Mm -hmm. So he just picked up a bunch of vinyl records, Fleetwood Mac and Michael Jackson, about three weeks ago. And he didn't have a record player to play them on. So I got him this in black because the price is undeniably yes, crazy. It is. It's uh, clearance price, so you're saving over 100 bucks from where it used to be priced. And then keep in mind, because we're not doing this again, it's on free shipping and handling and about $18 worth of easy pay. But Bob Rayner, even though this is my favorite Christmas song of all time, this is not just a record player. No, it's not. It's called an aviator. Aviator, right. What does that mean? Because it does more than records. In fact, we call it an aviator 8 and 1 because it does eight different things in almost every format of music, whether you're 8 years old or 80 years old, this will play it. And it brings back memories I was just talking with Lisa Rinna about, and she was saying, yeah, we p I played my dad's records, oh. and, and everyone does. In fact, I have a little story about a, a record I can tell you in a moment. But here's the point. Before you even turn it on, look at it. It's a fine piece it's of furniture. It's all wood, right? Yeah, uh, uh, look at this solid wood top with this beautiful wood grain finished like this. Composite wood with wood veneer all everywhere else. You have this absolutely gorgeous woven and grill cloth, leather at covering, antique bronze accents. This causes a conversation and attracts attention as a warming piece of furniture in your home before you even turn it on. But and look at what it does. Look, <laughs> so there is the place where the vintage vinyl goes. Yep, you but bet. You bet. You can record vintage vinyl yes. onto CD or Bluetooth mm -hmm. or cassette because this is like that multi, it even plays AM and FM radio. Yes, it does. The record player you're seeing here plays the uh, long play albums, it plays 45 RPM singles, and even the old 78 RPM records that your grandparents may have collected. Yeah. But that's not all. We come down to the front here, what do you see? A radio dial, AM, FM, stereo, listen to your news, talk stations, your sports, your ball games, just like they used to do in the old days, gather around the radio, FM music stations. Down here, an auxiliary input, meaning that you can plug in with the supplied cables, anything into a earphone jack from an iPod or anything else like that and play it through there. But wait, there's more because I'll hit that button there on the remote, which is included. And what does it say there? Blue. Meaning that you can wirelessly stream Bluetooth music right through that into the aviator from your iPhone, your mobile phones, your tablets, and so much more. These are finally down to just one color. And when yep. we started, we had five. Like Joe got black, I got it for him. We only have blonde oak now. Um, it is a multi-purpose entertainment device because it plays cassettes, CD, AM, FM radio, vinyl, which is super cool. And by the way, we're not reordering this. The price has been brought down so low. It is, it is nearly a giveaway. It is easily half off. Yes. And you're not even paying to get it shipped to you. Now keep in mind, um, here's a look at just one of the opportunities, which is the playing of the vinyl. Mm -hmm. We only have 3,000 left. Wow. Uh, look at that. Now what you just saw, like the modern day rock yeah, player. Yeah, tra a transformation. And it transformed right. into the aviator. The aviator just adds so much more vintage charm to a room. It does, it does. And you know, that transition you saw visually, a lot of times callers tell us we have our collection of records, we have our collection of cassettes, but we got rid of the way to play them. Now you can bring it back and share it with everyone. In fact, cassettes over there on the side of the machine, you see there's a cassette tape sticking out of there. Yes, it will play cassettes, but then we go from cassettes to something like this, which it also plays, which is cool. digital music stored on a USB thumb drive can plug right in there. So think about it, I said it moments ago, whether you're eight years old or 80 years old, this plays the format of music mm. that has the memories in your head and in your heart. So what's your story? You had a story about Oh, vinyl. yeah, well, I, I love to tell this. In fact, I told it to Lisa Rin a moments ago. I told it to mm -hmm. Scott, Scott Hind. I told it to Joe Campanelli. I was a little boy, five, six years old. My dad comes home from work one night, and he holds up a box. It's a portable record player and this record. I screamed and squealed with delight. I was a little boy, our first record player. Fast forward 50 some odd years later, I host the first Thanksgiving dinner ever I hosted for my family in my home. We're all gathered in the dining room. I have one of these in there. I have the very same record my dad carried into when I was a little boy. Oh, wow, I put this so record cool. on this on this device and played it. Let me tell you, 
Not a dry eye. There was in the a house. lot. There was not a dry eye in the house. That's oh, why I love to tell that story because this, I've been selling electronics here, presenting them 19 years. This is the most untechnologically concerned item I've ever presented simply because it's not about the technology. It's about how this brings the music from your life back into your life and you can share it with your friends and family. That is a real, that's, I'm not that's joking. That's what it's about. You that know? is such a tearjerker. That, that but right it's, there a true story, is and like I've heard a Hallmark lots. Channel movie right there. <laughs> I'm serious. Yes. I've been watching a lot of them. So yeah. um, I'll never forget growing up and my dad used to travel a lot and he used to travel to Brazil. And so one time he came home with an entire album of Brazilian music. And as a little girl, I was fascinated by the cover. Something so different. On the cover, it was like Samba Brazilian was this beautiful tropical toucan. And to this day, I have no idea what the band was, but I've never forgotten that album. It's funny, isn't it? How Even the album art did something yeah, for yeah. us. You know, we have these images. It's like, who doesn't have the image of Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club sure, Band sure. album cover, yep. which you would never see in a CD like you did on that big album it's cover, lovely. you know? It's and lovely. then, of course, you mentioned something. And if you, do you still have that record? What? That I'm record, sorry. that Brazilian record? Yes, wait, somebody's saying Antonio Carlos Chauvin? Chauvin, yeah. It's possible. Yeah, very it's possible. Yeah, because he was the famous one that did Girl from Ipanema. Oh my gosh. The famous man, yeah. Um, okay, so sorry, you well, were just. Well, anyway, I was saying that, you know, if you have that record or anyone, you can preserve them by recording them. Here's how easy it is to do. This is the icing on the take. Cake, I've already put a blank CD into the CD recorder. Now, let's say I want to record from the uh, record up here, okay, I want to record from the upper. By the way, you can also record onto the uh, uh, USB drive. Start what you want to record, press record here, and when you press that button there, you can record to either CD or USB, record to CD, press play. The tip of my finger and the touch of two buttons, and I'm now making a digital CD copy of that record. No computer, no software, no wires, no cables, nothing. My finger and the touch of two buttons. That's what really pushes this over the top. Not only enjoy all your music from the past, but preserve it and protect it by recording it onto CDs or USB, and then you can play them anywhere. Entirely half off. I mean, it's a little more than a hundred bucks, which is unbelievable. Yes, it's, it's, it's almost like a beautiful remarkable. piece of furniture, but it does so many things when it comes to sound and music. And of course, since we're not doing it again, we also threw it on free shipping and a really lucrative easy pay. But I do want to say in closing that it really is about the memories and just to look at it, Bob. Isn't it beautiful? It reminds yeah. me of a time that was just simpler, right? Just it was simpler, simpler and I love reliving it. Yeah, yeah, I bet. Well, thank you. Thank you, Sean. Such it's a been great a idea for a Christmas gift. Um, all right, so Lisa Renna's on the way, Sonicare is on the way.